as always, thank you very much for allowing us to be here today. It's an honor and a privilege to be able to recognize the outstanding work of our Central Ohio Law Enforcement Officers. So uh, for the month of May, uh, we'd like, uh, like to recognize Officer Brian Taylor. On November 15th of 2016, Officers Oxley and Brian Taylor were dispatched to a disturbance at the in-town suites on Bethel Road, which involved a female screaming. The female and her 12-year-old son were evicted from the motel because they were behind in their rent. The officers were able to calm the female down and then escort her back inside to get her personal belongings. The officers assisted the mother and child with packing everything they had inside of the mother's vehicle. Unfortunately, the car started and then died in the middle of the roadway. So the officers pushed the vehicle across the street into the Walmart parking lot. The officers determined that they had no other place to go due to the hour of the night and no family nearby. The mother was determined that she and her son would just sleep in the car until the morning because her son catches the bus in front of the in-town suites. So they thought they would tough it out for the evening. Officer Taylor used his own money and bought the child a sleeping bag, hand and foot warmers, and even gave them some cash to go to McDonald's for breakfast in the morning before the child got on the bus. Officer Taylor checked on them later in the night to make sure they were sleeping all right inside the car. Per his sergeant, Sergeant Spradlin, I know many of us have used our own money to help citizens out that were down on their luck. We do it because we see a need and most of us have children of our own. We do not do it to be recognized or to look good. Officer Taylor went above and beyond to help this family and it makes me proud to have him as part of my unit. Due to his humanity and generosity, we are pleased to name Officer Brian Taylor our May Officer of the Month. So Brian, on behalf of Crime Stoppers, the FOP, and United Dairy Farmers, we'd like to present you with this and thank you for your compassion and your work as a police officer. Thank you, sir. Thank you. It's a fine job. Thank you. That, that night uh, is a reflection on the Division of Police uh, and Zone 1 and 17th Precinct. And uh, we are extremely proud of them. And we want to reward this type of uh, police work. And uh, I think it, it shows what a great person he is and a great representative of the division.